Roy Christie's laying 15 to 8, so generally 74, but the Rails bookmakers still want to get her as Caramba has come in from 11 to 4 into 9 to 4, but now a 5 to 2 chance and very solid this morning shadows at 9 to 4. Running for the bookmakers, 8 to 1 Gay Galanta and 25 to 1 the, ra the Rag Arab Bride. But it's strange, the big bookmakers on the rails, they're feeling against Soraya on the boards, the public money, there's no doubt that's with the 1,000 guineas heroine. Right, the runners going into the post end for this uh, Falmer Six into the stalls. Arab Bride made the running last time. She doesn't make the running. It'll be interesting to see who does. I'd imagine the other four jockeys are expecting Jason Weaver to kick as the stalls open. And as they do, he does. And she takes command. This Arab Bride, pumped away in Philly, setting a steady pace. Gay Galanta, a caramba on the outside in their morning shadows. And Harry Year is just the back marker as they go through the first furlong or so. And it's Arab Ride leading to Caramba in second at a very steady 25 miles an hour, but increasing as Arab Ride takes hold of the bridle, striding on by length. To Caramba in second, and then Gay Galanta running the rail third. The pale colours of Warning Shadows and Harry Year the back marker, but in black and white, it's Arab Ride. The leader. Moving well, Caramba pulling hard under Michael Roberts, Gay Galanta running nicely for Pat there in the white warning shadows, Mick Kinane, and in the blue, Willie Carson has got them all in his sights. See how the race develops, it's still the steady pace, Arab Rive with the edge, they've passed halfway by three parts of the length, tempo increased to 35 miles an hour, Caramba is in second, Gay Galanta, uh, Pat Hedder the blue cap on the right, just being pushed along, warning shadows, and Harry here, Willie Carson is going to pull wide for a run, They've got two and a half to go. Galanta, Gay Galanta looks the first to crack as Caramba comes up on the outside of Arab Ride. Harry Year of the blue and white striped cap on the dark blue colours on the outside of Warning Shadows, but it's Caramba who goes for home, come down to the final furlong. There's going to be a blanket finish here, Caramba. Here comes Harry Year. Don't rule out Gay Galanta putting a big finish. Arab Ride is running well up towards the line. It's going to be very close indeed. And Gay Galanta and Caramba, a photo of oh, that is so close between Gay Galanta and Caramba, and then came Arab Ride and Harry Year, and these in front of Warning Shadows, who was last of all, and so the outcome of this, the foul mistakes. This is a very close call indeed, between, whoo, nearest to us uh, in the red with the white sash, number four, Gay Galanta, in the colours of the Cheveley Park, stud train at Newmarket by Michael Stout, and ridden by Pat Hedderine, nearest to us from this camera angle, the white cap of Lord Carnarvon on the filly, the Belmets filly, Caramba ridden by Michael Roberts. Back, uh, oh, a neck half a length down is Harry Year. Well did the black and white colours of Arabri come forward under Jason Weaver, but this is a close call. It's Gay Galanta, has Pat Edery galvanised the Michael Stout filly. Michael, whose horses have been hitting the target, but uh, narrowly missed the bull. And what a coincidence, this Caramba, the white cap on the outside, Michael Roberts has been ridden in her races previously by Pat Hedery. So if he's got home on Gay Galanta, this Group 2 victory will be all the sweeter. Gay Galanta, the blue cap, white cap, Caramba, and it's very much on the nod. Very close. 